During the riots, I saw a large crowd of people gathered outside Croydon's shopping centre, Central. I also saw a bus on fire and also a household shop burnt down to the brim. This was causing a lot of smoke. That was quite scary. I heard a lot of shouting and screaming and smashing of windows. The atmosphere was smoky, crowded and very loud. My own experience of the riots was that I happened to be in the area and at first never had a clue about what was going on. As I got nearer and nearer, I saw a large crowd entering into the house of Fraser with bundles of clothing. I thought, wow, there was no police in sight. At first, I was just stunned and watching. As people were coming in and out, the big, big mistake I made was picking up a top as someone dropped it. I did this once. I did not take the top. I simply picked it up and looked at it and put it back down. This was caught on CCTV. Then over a year later, I was arrested for handling stolen goods. I was so devastated as it was so long ago and I really wasn't one of the bad ones during the riots. This made me feel like I had let myself down and my family due to the shame it brought. It was most definitely not worth it as something so small became so big and has affected me. I think the 2011 riots happened because a lot of people were angry at the government and the dramatic changes that have been made. I hope it doesn't happen again because I'll definitely make sure I'm far away from it. But I don't believe it will happen again. A lot of youths were deeply punished for the part they played in the 2011 riots and I doubt they want a repeat of the harsh jail sentences they were given.